and welcome. My name is Monica Poe, and I'm the marketing manager here at Wavex. I'm excited to have you join me for the next episode in our video series, The Thread. If you haven't had a chance to watch the previous episodes, be sure to go back and watch them to learn about all things Wavex. If you have watched previous episodes, you might recognize our guest today, our CEO and founder, Kevin Turpin. Kevin, it's great to see you. Hey, nice to see you, Monica. Great. Well, you know, Previous episodes of The Thread, we've talked all about Wevix and its capabilities, and then the last time we had you on, we actually talked about Walt and a lot of its features, and wow, just, it is crazy. Are we seeing the demand or what? Uh, just the sheer number of Walt's that are leaving the warehouse constantly and the momentum, it, it just seems to be growing every day I come in. So why is this happening why is we having so much extraordinary success and just the rapid growth well that's a that's a great question you know um when we first started all of this we really started to to, to try to figure out a way to get the the worker right working with the enterprise and um and that's what we've done right so the the workers love it uh the good thing about waltz uh, which is our smart radio uh, is allowing the actual the worker to uh, go into the field and use tools they've never got to use before i mean let's just say right i mean they use a smartphone every day when they go home and they've never had anything in the field so what we did is we created a, a really affordable way to not only um, help out with the ones that are using a radio and, and bring that to all the way down to the very very front line right so it's been it's been awesome to see uh, all of the you know all the excitement that's happening. They're they're taking you know uh, a photo of an incident that might uh, stop from having a safety issue. Uh, they're they're using the product just as, as intended, and and they're excited about it. And 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 it's bringing great morale to companies. Uh, we're we're really really thrilled on the way of uh, how it's all the outcomes coming. But um, one of the biggest things I think that it's not only just the worker but the enterprise as well is enjoying it um, in the way of getting trust and, and learning things back from the worker that can help their processes. Uh, they never realize this. I think there's been a very over the last years of lack of technology, uh, you know, understanding the value that uh, the frontline workforce brings, and that's their voice. And, uh, you know, it's, it's been amazing to see this, this piece happening and, and coming together, and that's why they're, they're flying off the shelf. So we're, we're extremely excited, everything that's been happening and what we're doing. Um, you know, every customer that comes on, uh, they order their first round of them, could be 200, 300 of them. And they're always coming back for more. So it's uh, exciting to see that that what our plan of, of connecting every worker and, and helping the enterprise with the organization is working. And then also the, the data that's coming back on the enterprise side to, to help the worker. And uh, not only is that all going to connect itself together, it's only going to grow. Um, and, you know, where we go from here is just uh, it's going to be awesome. Kevin, that's great. I couldn't agree more. You know, I'm seeing it and feeling it every day. We're just, we're going hundred miles a minute from just the new hires to the products coming in and out the door, like you talked about. So, you know, this is the success of Webix though. Um, sure. We're having that. So what about our customers? You know, can you share with our viewers what our customers are seeing? You know, just what Absolutely. type of success are they having? Great, great question, right? I mean, you know, we talk about all this, you know, as a high level, but uh, when I look at it from uh, just tons of customers have given us great feedback, uh, our whole team, uh, the marketing team, our whole group is is listening to all the success. But, uh, you know, I could name a lot of them, but I would, uh, one of them just on the top of my mind um, happened this week. Uh, you know, they were really kind of skeptical at the very beginning of getting into Wevix going, man, do I give devices out to all of my people? I don't understand. Why would I do that? Right. And we know that was the hesitation at the beginning. Um, it's kind of like just how uh, police officers were wearing, you know, body cams and they had the video going, man, why would I do that? And then they start seeing the value of what that does for them and protects them. Right. So uh, with that said, we're one of the customers this this uh, this week was like, you know, we didn't think that this was really going to work and we had a morale problem. Um, you know, we've had a couple safety issues and we, we just never could ever get this around and even optimization. We couldn't really figure it out. And uh, so he said, oh, we went we went with it. We trusted what you guys were saying about the information, the data, the Wevix, the whole concept of the platform and uh, started using the platform. And he said, man, what have we figured out? He said, I don't know why we have of, of, you know, not heard the voice from the frontline workers that do the things every day. And it's amazing on what we've received. 
Uh, not only have they given us good ideas, they've communicated areas where things uh, obviously were going to be either a safety issue or even a, a piece of machinery that was going down or areas of concern they could have it. He said it was a little overwhelming at first just because a lot of input was coming in. But then they just built the trust on how hard, uh, you know, the frontline workforce that they have is doing their job and then all the work pr processes that they've used uh, to change. And, he, and, and he said, I'll tell you what, I, it, it was a lot of the enterprises had the problem on the work process because they weren't listening to the person that was actually, you know, in the field. Um, an example I'd give you is kind of like if you look at the NFL, right? Um, you know, we look at that back five years ago. We had no data technology on any of them. And uh, we now have everything, how fast they can run, where they go, you know, all the things to improve not only the athlete, but also improve the organization to, to win games. And uh, so that's what we're doing, right? We're, we're taking that Walt, which is our smart radio, and uh, that helps the worker do everything they need to do, uh, communicate, talk directly through our global directory, take photos on incidents that could happen. If you might be in a hotel where uh, there's a leak in the ceiling that never would have known about, right? They can, they can notify as, a, as a, um, a cleaner that might be in there doing their job. We get, we get quicker and faster information. You know, other, other areas are, uh, you know, around uh, factories and things that where they never really would have just gone to work, done their thing and done that. So all in relation, you know, the customer this week really, really uh, brought a smile to my face going, you know, this is working, you know, thousands of devices are leaving on a daily basis. And, uh, you know, we are super excited for the future uh, and, and more products that will be coming out is just going to be extremely excited for sure. Awesome. Okay. You said something that I just, I want to pinpoint on. You said thousands of devices. Yeah. Uh, do you, you know, do you see any issues with inventory in the future because of that? I mean, that's a good question, right? I mean, that's kind of in the news everywhere. Well, it was at least a couple of years ago. Um, you know, actually, no, you know, we have gotten way ahead of our, uh, it's, we're not like our competition that's, uh, that's having inventory problems. Uh, we built this very affordable. And uh, as all of our manufacturers that work for and build all of our Weavix products, uh, we worked way ahead of this. We knew this was going to be a success. Uh, we've kept... Uh, we kept it very easy in the way of how we actually uh, produce and manufacture. We don't have like thousands of SKUs, you know, of different products. It's very simple, uh, very affordable. And so we, we actually have gotten way on top of that and we've, uh, we've got ahead of it. So, nope, we, we want to have one of our other areas is to deliver upon when we receive them. Now, some customers, when we first started, we weren't ready for this overwhelmingly, you know, uh, uh, people coming in so fast, right? But we're on top of that now, right? And into 2023 is going to be an extraordinary year. Uh, it's going to be a record year. It's going to shock the world. Uh, so nope, we're, we're on top of it and uh, keeping ahead of it. So for everybody out there that's watching this, right, uh, come check us out and uh, we'll show you what it is. And we have, you know, really a um, no risk guarantee type of piece that shows what we are is what we say. And uh, yep, inventory is coming in the door. Kevin, that sounds great. The future looks bright here. I'm excited to be a part of it all. Um, and then we'll get to share it all in the thread for all of our viewers, which right. sounds even better. So we do have to end the conversation today. Um, but as I've said before, if you want to hear more from Kevin and see more of the action around here, be sure to connect with him on LinkedIn. Weavix is also on LinkedIn, as well as Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. You can find all of the social media handles down in the description. And if you've not watched any previous episodes of The Thread, be sure and go back and watch them, especially episode three, where Kevin went into the need for wall and a lot about the wall and its features. So lastly, if you want to be the first to know when the next episode of The Thread will air, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks, guys. Bye. Right. Bye. Thank you.